Hello everybody, Jed here, and a welcome back to my Burgon playthrough here in Total War Warhammer 2, where things are going reasonably well. We are starting to push back everybody. Um, we're prepping for war with uh, the inevitable new war with it's uh, we're moving my army of foot knights back down as fast as we can and we've got ourselves a lovely diamond mine guys so yeah things are going very well here um obviously these guys are also at war with the elves over there um it's slow and steady here you know i'm not in any rush to throw myself at things that we've got a Solid army now. Now, theoretically, I could get Grail Knights in here as well, which would be serious overkill. Um, yeah, a load of Grail Foot Knights, uh, which, to be fair, I think I do want to do. No! The, the Dowie and the Mountain have been wiped out. That's not good. Oh, that's where they put the pass in. Okay. Um, you know what? I think I am going to recruit some Grail Knights into Grail Foot Knights into here because why the hell not? Um, they actually do less weapon damage, we have less weapon strength than Questing Knights, but that melee defense. Hmm. I guess they're shielded. They are perfect vigor, to be fair is the key thing for them and the fact their attacks are magic um they're definitely better than these guys so yeah i'm gonna swap Blessings four of those of in for four of uh, these guys and we're gonna pull these guys out into another army which means i need a new lord uh let us have a look Do you know who i am moving out uh, if in fact do you know who I am? He can recruit them. I can only recruit 10. I, as I build more of these buildings, I think I do. Do I increase my capacity? No, I think I'm just limited to how many I can have in total with the mod. So, well, there's an easy way of finding out. We'll, we'll build one somewhere else at some point, but not just yet. Uh, Oh, I've got to go through this one to get to that. Hmm. Uh, we may as well do the uh, one of the, for one of these, which is uh, lizard men now. Green tide, winter woes, Norska, Deft grip, forests edge, no wood elves, deserts purge. Yeah. There isn't actually one. Versus Lizard Man. How strange. Uh, water pump stand for the extra income. Let us see how we're doing. Devotee of the lady. Right. I thought she was staying here, to be fair. I see much. My sight is yours. Yeah, she is definitely meant to be staying there. We will have lots of new shiny knickets soon. You, you need a vow. Uh, rank up five times so he can have a vow of chivalry. Oh, 
to recruit him a paladin. Virtue paladin. confidence. To the yard, man. And again, he can take the vow of chivalry for leveling up. There we go. Oh, the other one are sitting just outside. Next turn, obviously, we need to do a little bit of switcheroo because it's going to be expensive, but it's going to be expensive having the, the even the Knight's Herod in the other army. Demand, I hear you. Oh, well, that makes my mind up about who I'm going to war with next. Uh, with our newly minted Grail Knights, guys. Uh, we'll send the trinkets to Bretonia because I'm fine. And it's Bordelais. We have been doing Fair Britonia! Your know, standing with Britonian Jigdoms is really good. More and more people are coming to the new continent. Nice! All oh, that's nice, the global recruitment. The recruitment duration for all units. That is lovely. Valiant Lord. They're still expensive, but they're less so. Right. Sorceress. On our before glory. March. Um, you. Yes. You can head north to join them. My deeds are legend. My legend inspires. Lord. What units did we get recruitable from that? Nice. Some proper questing knights as well. Um, I'm not going to use them yet. They are there if I ever need them. Obviously, we're going to level here up and level the diamond mines up. And build some walls. Okay. These guys are fools. Um, I mean, why? Why would you risk going to war with me? Um, I mean, I guess they obviously don't think it's a huge risk. I'm going to sit here with you. Oh, do I... Do I trespass to go straight for there? No. Going We're going to bring everybody north. They could come through here, but I think that's unlikely. Um, and position ourselves to smash them into pieces. Oh, and Itza took some of the Dwarven territory as well. So, yeah, decisions have been made. The uh, lizards are being driven out of the territory, having declared war on the on the peace-loving dwarves of the mountains, guys. Um, who never did anything to them. And then the continent will be pretty much ours, to be fair. I serve the lady. I no, you can stay there for now. My strength and wisdom are yours. My strength and wisdom are yours. Do you know who I am? get deadly onslaught okay slowly does it i can also recruit the green knight if needs be but i'm gonna try and re uh, resist the urge to grab the green knight just yet if i can avoid it i don't need to be double timing oh god okay she needs to pull back into the wellspring um she's a little cut off there and i don't think i've got walls in the wellspring which does potentially make it Welcome problematic. Uh, no. Basically. I have no desire for anything like that. Um, other than trade with back home. Because I don't want to be drawn into uh, wars back home. An unpeasant business. Oh. Oh. Yay. Protector of the realm. I see my path. Yes. Blessings of the lady be upon you. 
That is quite a tough, tough lizard men army, but then again, I am building grail foot knights and questing foot knights. Um, nope. They are being driven back a little bit. That's good. That war basically means Itza is preoccupied, so less likely to go to war with me. Um, hmm. Oh, the defenders of great plan still hold somewhere as well. Um, they are the only lizards which haven't gone to war. Because I'm, I think I'm going to lose a battle here. God damn! Alison Lebu will fight. Uh, she will fight with the peasant forces here. Um, obviously. You know, they are just doing their job to hold the line here. But if they can hold, you know, if they can either hold, if they need to either hold or die, causing enough damage to the lizard men menace. Um, the lizard man menace here to uh, basically defend us. So basically stop them being able to do anything else. Right. Infantry. <sighs> this is going to be a, a fairly cheesy defensive Moving setup, if I'm honest, because I can't do much else. You guys are going to be uh, just in front of the front line to soak up some of their ranged. Squares. Armed and ready. Squares. Again, you guys are going to sit just behind there. Orders, my lord. Squires. We fight for Bretonia! Spearmen at arms! For the lady! Tilt! Aye! Peasant bowmen! May as well move it all a bit for forward. These guys are basically all here just to watch my flanks a bit. Horses ready! Fighters! And you guys may as well start forward on skirmish mode! Out here! Get them moving! Get them behind to try and keep their forces as split as possible! Oh, mixed drags here with the peasantry on the very front. The, the, the raw recruits on the very front, guys, there. Um, everybody else and the lizards coming in here. Sending their skinks in first. Oh, they're stopping. And that's why we've got our shields on the front. Because they will soak up some of those spears. The men of Bretonia will hold firm. Oh. There we go. Right, so we are engaged. Let us uh, walk our swordsmen forwards. You guys can start pushing out, out round the flanks. Cav, move. 
You guys can move into the flat center there a bit. Now they obviously have a lot of reinforcements coming in, so I want to make sure we are very much in defensive mode. Oh wow, we're actually breaking them. The, the boys of Bretonia are holding nicely here. For now. Slam into those Sora spears. Oh, if I can hit that slam, actually, that'd be great. Uh, one of you can hit them. Obviously, I don't want these guys to get caught when this force comes in, but the more damage I can do here before we get there, the better. I might hit some on my own here, but I'll do much more damage to them. Slam into the rear here. Come on, boys. Into those skinks. You guys can break off and slam into the back here. You three, reform up there. Start pushing through with some of these units. Cavalry, pull out. All of my range can kill that goddamn slam. We're holding there. You guys can move forwards to try and reinforce. We don't really need you there. Got a bit of a mess going on here, but we're doing fine. We are breaking the Saurus Old Blood and the Saurus Scar Veteran is struggling. They do still have some units there, but we're, we're, we're holding it. Here comes the next line. Oh, slam into those Saurus Warriors. Ready for battle! Arms and ready! All men, ready! So we're trying to soak up the circuit, circuit, and circle them there a bit. Let's Has try and clear this flank off. Kill them! Shifted. Keep marching ready. forwards. That. It's probably our most worrying thing here. That's perfect. We've broken them. Let's get down here. Well, we've enraged them anyway. Let's break through. There's so few of them. They shouldn't really be able to push us far. My halberdiers can get onto that ancient salamander and you're going to get right into the flank here. I need you guys on that salamander. Okay, you guys can push up on this flank now. Quick now. Yes. You guys can all surge. I'm not fussed by them. Uh, all of my range can actually hold here. We serve our leads. Here, my cavalry has bloke broken through. If I'm honest, I actually want them down on here. Here it goes. It's the mounted yeoman charge. And we are fighting the Saurus warriors here. We're doing well, actually. I'm a bit surprised. The, the battles, I'm a bit concerned by what's going on back here. My archers shouldn't really be dealing with this, but they can hold. To be fair, they're pretty much out of the goddamn ammo. Pushing through. In fact, we need support in the rear of here. Attack! Run! You honor us. 
have charge. Not particularly powerful charge, but a good enough charge. No battle versus Sork versus Lizard Men is ever short. Come on! This second force, which is becoming the problem. I need, I need range support in here. With haste. Again, gonna clip some on my own, but mostly hitting them. Nice. Orders to Get you out on this flank. Let's try and burn that one off. That, no, let's hit that goddamn salamander. Like it. This is turning into... We, we've held the line, but this is we're turning done. into a bit of a melee, and we are beginning to have Please units cracking. From the depths, let's move in and support this flank. Hit him, hit him, hit him, hit him now. If I can take him out, the morale will help us. For the king. God damn hate fighting temple guards. But considering these are peasant units, I mean they are incredibly veteran peasant units now. It would be a shame to lose this army. Um, I love the chair just sitting there in the middle of the battlefield. Holding just about here. My, power comes. My cavalry is completely committed here. I may be able to pull them out for another charge, but... Kill them all! Spires! Have at him! getting... Getting fraught. Okay. Another recovery charge into those that skink cohort. The boys have begun are holding well here, but I've got a feeling they are not gonna last a huge amount longer. Can't believe they're still actually holding on. Ooh, we made a nice dent there, at least. God help us! Smash them! Slam into that skin cohort before it gets back, gets its morale fully back. If I can break God it again, that's us. great. Damn. Take Too slow. Get in! You're out of ammo. I need every able-bodied man in this fight. These temple guard are obliterating us. I mean, these guys are seriously veteran, which is why they're not breaking, but still. Oh, why they weren't breaking, they are starting to break now. Up here. I want them up here. Come on! Like it said, come on, lads! My archers getting involved with the temple guard! Oh, I took at least one down! No. I 
think it's over, guys, basically. Priestess of the Lady! Bit of control A action here to try and save the lady. Oh, wow. What a battle, though. I mean, we may, we may have lost, but the Bretonians, they showed their metal. And these were, you know, to be fair, these are good, solid units I'm, I've lost here. You know, they are veteran, some of them more veteran than others, but they are, uh, you know, imported units. They have, oh, it's such a shame to lose that army. They have been worth their weight in gold. I suspect... What the lizard men lost is of much more value than what I lost. So Alison Libu Libo did her job beautifully there. Uh... Valiant defeat. But a good enough defeat. A good enough, you know, it may be a defeat in the battle, but not the war, because we held, we held the line for long enough. While many a Bretonian may have died that day, they, they ever uh, furthered the goals of Burgon. My reputation proceeds. And they will be avenged by Marcel and uh, Cedric, who looks a little different. For some strange reason. Can't imagine what that is. Sorry, if you want to know what that is, go read the uh, storyline from uh, Wurzag. If he was higher level, I would be smashing these guys in. Um, but I can't afford the, <laughs> the cost of getting them. Having an actual cavalry swarm army in behind us would be fantastic. Um, anyway, that's where we're going to leave it for today, guys. So, unfortunately, a, a bit of a defeat, a bit of a negative. Um, but, yeah, uh, I'm using, obviously, we're recording a 1440p now because I've got my lovely 1440p screens. I'm also playing with the quality at the moment, so please let me know what you thought of the quality, guys. As always, if you have enjoyed this as well, please do like and subscribe, guys. Uh, really does help my channel. Any likes, dis even if you disliked it, pop a thumbs down and let us know why. Let us know what you didn't like, guys. Other than that, as always, a massive thank you to my patrons. It really does help um, help the channel, everybody who does support me on Patreon or through YouTube. You can either do that through Patreon by clicking the link down below or hit hit join here on YouTube. Please do consider that if you, if you can. Obviously, as far as I'm concerned, everybody who watches is awesome, however, and thank you very much for watching. Cheers all.